Hello to everyone watching this footage. It's Leviathan here again, and to start things off, I'm going to introduce myself to newcomers. I'm a high functioning autistic, I'm obsessed with fiction, and I'm planning to make my own creative universe like the late Stan Lee did. I apologize for not making this video yesterday, so I'm doing it today just to make up for it. And I got three, but figuratively speaking, four characters to introduce, but it's mainly three. I'll just cut to the chase. Olsen Duo. Real name, Mary and Meg Olsen. Height 225 feet from Mary, 173 feet from Meg. Weight, 6,000 tons from Mary, 2,500 tons from Meg. Status, anti-hero in Team Towers members. Base, Alpha Earth Mobile. Intelligence, 2.5 brains from Mary, 4 brains from Meg. Behavior, confident from Mary, Intellectual from Meg. They'll do anything to complete any mission that they are assigned to. Lethality. Highly deadly to most opponents. Weaknesses. Neither can live without the other. Powers. They both have great size and strength, along with being unable to age. Mary is the brawn, while Meg is the brains. They are also better at defeating enemies via teamwork. Eyes. Lime green for both. Hair tannish blonde for both. Origin. Mary and Meg Olsen were a late 20s mother and a 4 year old daughter in their previous lives. One day they were transported by Gigantica into an experimentation for world conquest. In the process, Mary and Meg were infused with colossal sizes, and Gigantica brainwashed them to destroy the New York of the default Earth. However, the Olsen duo were confronted by the Nelson twins until they finally got their brainwashing disabled. Realizing what happened, the Olsen duo will now do all that they can to keep history from repeating itself, and eventually became new members of the Team Towers. Costume. They dress in casual wear. Team Solitary or with other heroes or its inspiration, Symbiosis. Here's the next character. Quizzer. Real name, Peggy Riddle. Height 5 feet inches, 8 inches, weight 146 pounds, status anti-hero and master of mystery, base mobile, intelligence 4 and a half brains, behavior, intellectual and unexpected, she always enjoys mind games, lethality, only if you answer her incorrectly, weaknesses, she has no healing factor, her powers would completely disable as soon as you answer her correctly, powers, she can think up any riddle, if you don't answer her riddles correctly, you'd lose all memories or get transported to a different dimension. She also has high agility, martial arts, and is good at hiding. Eyes greenish turquoise, hair blonde and curly. Origin Peggy Riddle was an average woman who ran out of gas for her car in the middle of the North American desert. While she walked to find help, Peggy found a greenish turquoise crystal on a rock, which was a crystal that Voodoo recently discarded. When Peggy touched the crystal, not only did it lose its color and became fragile, but it also infused her with mystery-based powers. Eventually, Quizzer decided to use her powers to rob the National Bank until she was defeated by Supernova and Q-Girl. After a time in the Outer Darkness, Quizzer was finally rescued by Psycho and soon joined forces with the mentally disturbing Sisterhood of Surreal. Costume she wears a turquoise leather suit covered all over with backward question marks. Team Solitary with the Sisterhood of Surreal or others. Or inspiration, DC's Riddler. Here's the last character, just so you know. Zwap. Real name, inapplicable. Height, 2 feet. Weight, 8 pounds. Status, anti-hero and master of swapping. Base, default earth, mobile. Intelligence, 3 and a half brains. Behavior. Intellectual and sneaky, he loves surprising people. Lethality, only in terms of his powers. Weaknesses, he's a horrible fighter. Powers, he can instantly switch the powers or bodies of heroes, villains, and anti-heroes. He also has a high intellect. Eyes, bright, bl bright green lights. Hair, none. Origin, one time, Gigantica decided to have some way to make her opponents struggle with their powers. After a kind of time of construction, Gigantica created a small robot that possesses a special beam system that could switch the powers and bodies of others. Naming him Zwap, Gigantica commanded him to use his powers to destroy Pym and Colossa. 
After traveling to them, Zwap instantly made their power switched. However, Colossa also explained to Zwap that chaos isn't the only part of life. After that, Fem and Colossa used their new powers to defeat Gigantica, later gaining their powers back from an understanding Zwap. Since then, Zwap would do anything to be accepted by others, even by using his powers for the betterment. Costume. He simply wears nothing. He doesn't need to wear anything. Team. Solitary. Or with others. Original inspiration. Power and body switching. And he also talks like this. I am Zwap. How are you today, right now? I switch powers and bodies. <laughs> That's funny. I hope you like what I have to show you. You know, he talks like that. Just to give you an understanding. And uh, there's an undisclosed chance that I could have a co-star at some point in the future. Someone who's willing to ask questions about my creations mid-video because I just need my videos to be more comfortable for myself along with for you guys, you know? I'm just I'm trying to make a win-win solution some way, somehow, you know? And if you guys want, you could like, subscribe, comment down below, and share if you want. You know how it is. Hope you guys have a fine rest of the month, and until next time, in transmission.